Let's get right to it. There are jobs out there for researchers. If you want to become an AI researcher, then knock yourself out. Just make sure you've got a PhD or you're in a PhD program. Almost every researcher role requires it. If you want to do research, you should know that the salaries are about half of what you'll be making as a machine learning engineer. Here's a role in my neck of the woods. The role is paying about 100 k A very nice salary, no doubt, but a third of what most of my colleagues building real-world production models make. Here's another role at Microsoft. Again, the top in salary is about half of what a production machine learning engineer is going to make. I have no problem with researchers. They created the models I use every day. However, the models I use every day are already created, and they've been battle-tested. Companies don't need help with modeling. That's become the easy part. Again, the top models are already created. What companies need are programmers and data people that can massage massive troves of data into a modelable state. Companies don't need pontificators. They need doers. A doer in machine learning can work the end-to-end -end machine learning pipeline, not just the modeling aspect of it. We talked about model democratization yesterday. I'll put a link below to that video so you can take a look at it. Modeling has become the easy part. There's no easy part to sourcing and cleansing data in preparation for modeling. Recently, I worked on a project where there were four different data sources. I had to import the data into a relational database where I could then author the queries to source the data. This took weeks. The files were CSV files and JSON files. It was a mess. This was just the sourcing part. The data set was massive, so it had to move to the cloud for modeling. Once the data was in a single table or an array in BigQuery, I had to clean it up. That took a few more days. All these steps had to be done before a single model was built. When I say we need doers, I mean we need people with data skills and cloud skills that can take a project from end to end. The phrase end to end simply means you're given a project, you source and cleanse the data, you create the model, and then you put that model in production. Companies need people that can work the entire pipeline, not just the modeling part, which we've already noted is mostly democratized. I'm not trying to steer you away from research. However, you need to understand that's not what most companies need, and it's why the salaries are so far apart. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and have a great day.